Hi everyone, my name is Alex. Today I'm going to be trying the Anua Hydrating Gentle Foaming Cleanser. This product retails for $11. I am so excited for this new water-based cleanser launch from Anua. I did try out their original cleanser and I feel like it was really designed for more oily skin types. That is their water-based cleanser. I have also tried their oil-based cleanser. I've tried so many Anua products on this channel. So when I saw they released this, I purchased it immediately. This is really exciting because even though I am more combination skin and it is the summertime, I still love going for a more hydrating cleanser, especially during the daytime. I do find myself having to cleanse more in the summer. And also to see Anua has branched out and released a cleanser that is more designed for dry skin types is really exciting for me. This product is vegan, cruelty-free, fragrance-free, alcohol-free, and comes in recyclable packaging. The highlight ingredients in this product include glycerin, zinc, and panthenol, but they have amazing ingredients in it, check out the full ingredient list. Make sure you click the link in the description to go to their website. So since this is a more hydrating cleanser, the big things I'll be looking for with it include how well does it cleanse. Sometimes when cleansers are more designed for drier skin types, it means they are more moisturizing, which isn't necessarily a bad thing. Sometimes it can mean it doesn't cleanse my skin as much as it needs. I also want to see if it leaves any finish or film on the skin. As for anything else, I'll be continuing to check in. So I will see you all in the next check-in. Hi everyone, I'm here to give you all a quick check-in on this product. I am actually doing my nighttime routine, so I just double cleanse and I still have damp skin. I have used this product only once and it does have an extremely moisturizing texture. It's so thick it's almost hard to get out of the packaging. It feels like a moisturizer going on the skin and then it does foam up slightly whenever you add water. And so far, it hasn't been stripping to my skin whatsoever. It's been a very nice cleanse from what I can tell. It does have a light foam to it, which I really enjoy. It just feels like such a nice cleanser. And it doesn't leave my skin stripped. That is the biggest thing. When I saw foaming cleanser, no matter if they say it's designed for dry skin, sometimes brands will say that and then it will be an extremely stripping cleanser. This is not the case with that whatsoever. It's just a little bit difficult to get out. It just has this really moisturizing texture to it that I've really fallen in love with. It is a fragrance-free cleanser, so it does kind of smell. I mean, it smells like a fragrance-free cleanser to me but I love how well it has been doing to cleanse the skin without being stripping. Because it is the summertime right now, I sometimes prefer to go for a more purifying cleanser in the summertime, especially at night. But I love this product because it does do such a great job at cleansing while also leaving the skin feeling moisturized and not stripped whatsoever, which is very rare for a foaming cleanser, but they have somehow really nailed this product. I will also be able to tell how well it cleanses because when I've tried cleansers that are more hydrating, that don't do as well to cleanse the skin, I noticed that it just, some of my pores end up being clogged and I just, I, I really can tell when a cleanser does not work for me. So we'll keep you posted on that. This is also a very affordable cleanser as well. You get a ton of this product. As I start to add water, you can see there it really foams up. It's just a perfectly balanced cleanser in my opinion. It doesn't take much because I just used a tiny bit and this is, this is what we're working with. And after drying off my skin, doesn't feel very tight. Definitely does feel like I need to go in with a moisturizer, but considering how foaming it is, my skin feels pretty normal. Doesn't feel tight or anything. It is a really nice cleanser from what I can tell so far. I'm really enjoying this product, so I will continue using it. Now I'm checking again. Hi everyone, I'm back to give you all my final thoughts on this cleanser. I was really impressed with this product. This is a very hydrating cleanser, even though it does say it is foaming. And honestly, it was the most most balanced cleanser that I have tried recently. This is a really impressive launch from Anua with an amazing ingredient list attached to this product. It had a lot of nourishing ingredients in it that proved to be effective at cleansing my skin while also leaving my skin not feeling stripped. This was a really well-rounded cleanser and my favorite part about it was its ability to cleanse without stripping the skin. When they say this is a foaming cleanser, it is very light and it's not something that I personally found to be too dry 
trying for my skin type. Now it is the summer right now, so I am a little bit more oily in my T-zone. I would be curious to see how this product performed in winter, but something I noticed with a lot of more hydrating cleansers is that if it's not cleansing well enough, then I will start experiencing breakouts. An effective cleanse is really important when it comes to preventing acne, and with this product, it was very nourishing for the skin, while also being very balanced and not stripping the skin whatsoever. I feel like this is a perfect, well-rounded cleanser for any skin type. I personally found it was the perfect cleanser for both day and nighttime use, at least in the summer. I will keep you posted on how this cleanser performs in the winter. They've packed so many great ingredients in this product to make it a very balancing cleanser, and this definitely is my preference of a cleanser from Anua when it comes to their water-based cleansers. The other one that I tried was just way too stripping for my skin type. This one was perfect. It had a really moisturizing feel while also being extremely effective, and so for that reason, I would 100% recommend trying out this product. At the time of filming this, I think it's only available on Amazon. I'm sure they will come to other Korean skincare websites soon. I'm really impressed with this product. I can't wait to continue using it, and I would 100% recommend trying it. But anyway, thank you all so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it and you want to see more like this, make sure to subscribe because I post new videos every week, and I will see you all in the next review.